Could you mention a few of what you think your most important policies would be when you're DA? What's so important and what I'm trying to accomplish with this office is to bring humanity into the conversation. It's important that we decline as many cases as possible that stem from social inequities like poverty and homelessness, substance use disorder. We're gonna decline these cases and hand them over to our partners, our community-based organizations that we are also funding to address these root causes and help people turn their behavior around. The second thing that's important is to have a sentence cap of 20 years. People age in prison at a rate 10 years faster than our average rate outside of prison. The United States is known as having the highest security nursing home. And the data and research has shown that people over the age of 55 don't even engage in crimes or commit crimes as 18 to 34. How can we expect people to successfully integrate when we've broken them down so much? Capping our sentences at 20 years with opportunities for release as early as possible is a priority and ensuring that we have real measurements of success. My goal is to make this office accountable, transparent, and collaborative. So that means making sure the community has a seat at the table and is partnering with my office to make sure we are approaching this from a public health perspective and it's a holistic response to the needs of our communities.